A heartbreaking day for the Atlanta Fire Department and firefighters across the metro as they lose one of their own. Yeah. Firefighter Frank Martinez battled cancer for years, and early this morning, he lost that battle. Fox Eyes Natalie Fultz lets Martinez's friends share their memories of a great man and a great firefighter. This is where firefighter Frank Martinez spent many days, and those who knew him best say although he may not be here anymore, his legacy will live on. His dignity, his respect, his honor, his sense of humor, and um, he's just a good person that everyone, uh, I believe, could look up to. Shields commemorating fallen officers and firefighters line the hallway of the Atlanta Public Safety Building. Officer Cortez Stafford says just like these men and women will never be forgotten, neither will firefighter Frank Martinez. Even knowing his fate, he was still a very positive um, image to the department, a positive image to his family, a positive image to his sons. Early Tuesday, the husband and father of two passed away after battling stage four cancer. I knew Frank when he was at his best, when he was strong, healthy guy. Um, and to see someone have to battle through that and basically deteriorate from such a strong person, that's a, that's a very sad part. Back in November, an emotional display of brotherhood as public safety personnel from all over Metro Atlanta led a procession from Martinez's cancer treatment facility in Noonan to his home in Forsyth County. All those guys were out there saluting or standing at attention, um, just giving him, you know, the, the courage to kind of go on and, and fight. Officer Stafford says the six year veteran with the department left an even longer impression on everyone he met. He remained as strong as he could through that fight. So that's that's something anybody and everyone could take with them, no matter what they're going through. As for funeral arrangements, Officer Stafford tells me all those details are still being worked out. As soon as we get that information, we will pass it along. In Atlanta, Natalie Foltz, Fox 5 News.